yesterday I washed my car as you can see it's kind of shiny and uh, I didn't wax it normally I just wax it uh, on Sundays once a week and I wash it uh, twice a week so yesterday was just the washing and as you can hear there's raining outside too bad all the just the risk I have to take during these rainy seasons but I still do wash it um, now what I'm gonna do is um, I decided to show you uh, now on this on this season the type of of wax I'm using uh, it's a uh, the camera just twisted the name but it's a uh, hydrophobic uh, nano carnauba wax it has some nano uh, polymers that help with a hydrophobic effect with the water so what I'm gonna do um, I'm just gonna cover half of the hood and since it's raining and I have to go outside I'm just gonna wait um, I'm gonna film how this reacts with, you, with the rain now um, like I said I'm just gonna apply half of the hood and let it sit, it dries really fast okay. this is the paste it's, uh, it's kind of solid but you just put some on the pad really easy, it goes really it absorbs it really easy and then just paste Now you may notice that um, I do not use the circular motions, I just go straight back and forth and this is because one of the guys on YouTube, uh, it's a pretty famous detailer guy, said something that made me think and is that no matter how hard you try, you will somehow leave some Swirl mark and some scratches. So, in, if you leave circular swirls, it's gonna be a lot um, harder to remove than just um, like straight scratches. I don't know. I have both in my car because even if I try really hard to to clean the the washing mitts and everything. Um, it turns out I do have some scratches. So I just apply it. Okay. Like I said, it dries really fast, and I can see what I'm doing the second pass. It kind of removes the upper layer. But anyway, uh, I'm just going to leave it like that for a couple of minutes, come back, remove it, and take the car outside. Okay guys, so five minutes have passed. Uh, the directions on the wax say that you can apply it and remove it straight away because it actually dries really fast, but I normally wait. So now I'm going to remove it. It takes quite a, a bit of work to remove it because it is kind of sticky, unlike uh, carnauba wax, and it does leave some streaks on the hood or wherever you apply it, and that's really important because normally you don't see it under fluorescent light, but once you get out on the sun, you just re see streaks everywhere. So normally I do two to three passes and make sure that hood is really smooth. smooth. Okay. Okay. It seems. Um, nope. Okay, now I'm going to take the car outside and uh, see it with the rain. Okay guys, so <clears throat> the rain is not that strong, so the beads are just accommodating on the hood. But, uh, well, you can see kind of the bead separation 
and let's see if we can catch a drop plus the car is not moving so there's no wind that pushes the bids out so you can see once the drop falls it leaves no streak so it's uh, like a really smooth line that they leave if this was a harder rain or a stronger rain uh, it, the effect to be seen much better I'm also going to show you the, the wind shield I don't know if you can catch it well there's the reflection of the I also treated this with the nano skin. Uh, these guys put a product called the nano skin hydrophobic uh, treatment for the windshield. I'm up to three months and it really uh, works well. You can see the bits just falling straight away. Again, once you drive, it's much better because the wind helps with the bits moving out. Well, that's the idea, and I'm just gonna try with the hose, spraying with some water with the hose since it's already wet, and see how that goes. Okay, I got my hose here, and let's see how that works. So, as you can see, even I treated that side last week and it still works pretty well. This is the treated side right now that I did. It really looks pretty awesome because uh, once you drive, like I said, it removes the, the drops of water. I do still have some drops of water when I'm in parking mode and well, those stains remain on the hood, but at least for the rainy seasons, rainy season that works pretty well so hope you guys enjoy it oh wait I'm gonna show you the wind shield as well and one guy at, uh, at the pump store wanted me to try this product and that arsehole put a, a, a sample here when you see the spot and it removed the treatment but I don't care it's still working really well as you can see and if you guys want to try the product it's on amazon i believe so or any questions you got feel free to let me know peace